Irema Word Christian Academy. How you doing, young people? My glasses broke, so I'm going to put on these army glasses. Don't laugh at me. Don't throw stones at me. My glasses broke. I even show you my broken glasses. See, there's no like thing in there. See, I'll try to get them fixed, but let's see. So I got to put my army glasses on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Ta da! <laughs> it's sort of a shock, I know. I just wanted to give you a complete shout out. I got this. Uh, what does it say? Mr. Sherwin Students, IXL 10, pre calculus skills in IXL excellence in performance of t 10 pre calculus uh, skills. We're done. Okay. It's showing me that even though we don't have pre-calculus, people are reaching. People are reaching. People are thirsty for knowledge. My philosophy is just do it all in IXL. Do as much as you possibly can. Work ahead. You've done that. You proved it. And I'm so proud of you guys. And I think it's a complete team effort because if the culture wasn't there, the study culture the put more data in culture which is in ixl to go one more section it wouldn't wouldn't be possible but you guys feel great doing it this is another shout out the average score has raised 200 points 200 divided by two is two grade levels uh no 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 that's a hundred uh, yeah 200 divided by 100 is two grade levels. Look at this. This is where we were. We went up 200. But you see these jumps there? That was Christmas break. We did a complete jump. It detached. And those individuals who were so committed to doing it made it jump. And it jumped and it's continually going up. And those happen during a break. Isn't that interesting? how much people who are hungry for knowledge go up during a break. It's because there's excellent in habit forming. If you study the same time every day, your cognitive or your learning capabilities in your head, it gets easier and easier every day if it's, if it's habitual. Same time, same place. Even you see my background, it's the same. And so my mind doesn't have to get intrigued about a different color of wall or it's a different atmosphere in here. No, it's the same. Because that's how God made the human mind. It's the same. Okay. The only thing that needs to be different is the learning. What am I learning? The content it needs to sort of challenge. And as it goes up, there should be a uh, proximal... Uh, zone of proximal development meaning it's just trying to understand its confusion and then boom it eventually gets it and then it clicks when you get that click in math that means you got it it's in your cognitive but you got to be able to do it you know and use it all the time uh basically around the world america is known for working so i take that into my class working the problems not just talking about them However, as you notice, Miss Taylor came into my classroom, was it three or four weeks ago? She did such an excellent presentation that I do do presentations now. Short, just five minutes, one problem, 10 minutes. We, that's it. That's it. Lecture done. Start the problems. And so you got to take notes in the lecture when we are discussing the problem. And then doing it. Doing it. Okay, And that is pretty unique about this country because as I went to other countries, they are very theoretical, uh, very theoretical. Uh, over here, very application-centered, which is pretty cool because some of the best teachers I had were actually a couple of them, not everyone, but they were engineers. They actually knew how to build building. They, they knew what the tinsel straight of this or you know how big this was or how do you measure it. They just always related it to that, whereas uh, 
I just care about the numbers. <laughs> I don't care about the uh, what it's composed of, but they did too. So, so proud of you guys. So proud. Uh, what else do I want to share with you? 2,335 skills mastered. Let's bring it to about 4,500 before the year's over. 5,602 proficient skills. Let's bring that to about 8,000. How many problems have we done? This is what we've done. 200. 38,839 questions. Someone's doing them right now, so that's going up minute by minute, okay? Uh, let's try to get to um, 400,000, 500, maybe 450,000 before the uh, year's over. Okay. Let's see if I could bring up the screen because I'm shouting out those who are doing their activity during break because this is the habit forming time yes you're expected to do great in class and i expect that <clears throat> perfection in class however when you're doing it on your own that's a whole different story you're making a decision to do it that's just great let me see if i can even pull those up i think it's still uh, recording let me see yes shout out to alexis to Princess, to Samantha, to Georgelina, uh, to Ricardo, to Edson, to Jabari, to Iridia, to Maribel, to Wendy, to Mary, to Rosalba, to Samaya, to Ashante. Let me see after Shante. Just I just flipped the screen over to Wendy. Did I say Mirabel? I think I did. Uh, Ricardo, Mary. Oh, wow, I'm, I'm repeating some of this. Paris. Janara, Janara, and Olivier. Shout out to all you guys who are working so hard at doing uh, this stuff. Just keep doing it. Um, let me just give you a story. You know, my son, he goes to a school and they're using the iReady platform. And I go, just do 10, 10 problems a day because iReady is different. iXL usually teaches the skills, whereas iReady teaches the application of it. I don't consider it a better program because I, I, even though we do skills, I push to do more than just the application. Application, you got to spend a little more time, whereas skills, if you get them fast, uh, it could, we've got a broad base. We could do more, but uh, they do it a little deeper. Uh, but the programs I don't think is is cool because we automatically get our questions answers where they don't. We do. So I think we got it going on. Just a shout out to you guys. This is the fourth quarter. If I do teach anything in the summer, even or if I do videos in the summer, I'm going to teach, I think, how to review a book before class, which is how to review a math book correctly before you go to the class, not during the class, not how to rip it apart like that, not that and done, but how to get to do something you don't understand yet. I'm going to teach how to approach a um, math book for sure because I'm just, you know, get in, let me do the prompts fast, but there's a couple couple things you could I could teach you. I might also teach short stories how to what what to expect from a short story even before you read it and then when you're reading it what are you looking for and i don't know about a novel maybe maybe a novel i read roll what did i read uh, tolstoy anna karina that was a pretty good book pretty good book good writer um have a great going into uh Good Friday tomorrow when Jesus was crucified. Awesome. 
He did change the world out of everyone I ever read in history. He changed it more than Julius Caesar, uh, more than President Barack Obama, more than Tupac, more than General Patton, more than FDR, more than anybody Jesus did change the world through resurrection and his death and resurrection because he dealt with our sin problem. No other leader dealt with our sin problem. So he did. So enjoy yourself and great job. Shout out to you. Shout out to you. Let's get hungry for knowledge. We only have what? April, May, J you know, some, some change in June and then we're gone. 28 assignments. Don't forget 28 assignments, not 14. This is going to be a lot, but I'm giving notes and it's one assignment per day. Don't forget NWEA test is at the end of May. So we're going to spend that whole month doing, I don't know about the whole month, but you know, a long time doing, uh, preparing through third and fourth quarter exams. How do I look at it? Exam, Mr. Sherwin, I never want to be punitive with the exam. I want exams to be positive and good, hard. If it's not hard, it's, you know, has to be difficult. Meaning I got to prepare you for it and go through it, but they got to be good questions because if they're easy questions, why go over them? They need to challenge you and you need to feel good about it and you feel good about more difficult questions. Have a great day. You guys are awesome. Don't forget, get an IXL. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy IXL. Have a great day. God bless you. Bye-bye.